Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see how to fix Samsung Galaxy Watch 7 not vibrating for notification. So without wasting your time, let's get started. So the step one is to do, you can simple check that do not disturb mode is turns off. Okay. So when you simple scroll down to open quick settings and here you will find a minus icon. It means D and D means do not disturb. So if this feature turns on, it means your phone is your watch is under do not disturb modes. Then you will not see any notification, any vibration or any incoming calls. Okay. So make sure that the D and D is turns off. Okay. Because D and D is block the vibration and notifications. Okay. So after make sure that the D and D is turns off, you can simple move to our next step is adjust vibration settings. So make sure your vibrating settings are correctly configured. So you can simple open settings and then go to vibration and sound. Okay. And here you can simple see here that vibration with sound is turns on. Okay. Also you can simple here. You can select a vibration duration like short, long, light, strong and many more. Okay. So then you can simple scroll down and here you can simple see a system vibration option. Then you can simple turn this feature on and here you will find our different features that are able to show no vibrations with notification. Like when you touch interface, it will allow vibration, dialing keyboard, Samsung keyboard and charging. Okay. So you can simple ensure these features are turns on. Also ensure that you will find here a notification vibration. When you simple turn this feature, here you will find a different modes to select. Okay. So then you can simple adjust the modes. It's upon you that which type of vibration you want. Okay. So light, high, light and many more. So after make sure that the vibration settings are configured correctly. So you can simple customize the app notifications. Okay. So sometimes specific app notifications may not be set to vibration. So here how you can do it. So then you can simple go back and then go to notification. Okay. And here you can simple tap on app notifications. Here you can simple customize that which app you want to allow notification with vibrations. Okay. When and when you simple tap the application and then here you will find a allow notification option. Okay. So you can simple customize here. Okay. So after allowing the app notifications and still you are facing an issue. So it's time to check for a software update. So it sometimes our uh, previous softwares can cause issues. So to check our software update, you can simple go to software update in settings. Okay. And then tap on it. And here you will find download and install button. You can simple tap on it. So here's how they can simple check for any new update is available or not. So if any new update is available, you can simple click on download and install to download the latest version. So it will take 10 minutes to configure new update. So be patient on time. Okay. Or if your watch is up to date like this, my watch is up to date. So in this case, you can simple go back and ensure that your phone, your smartwatch is not mute. Okay. So when your watch is set to mute, it may not vibrate for notifications. Okay. So you can again go to sound and vibration and ensure that your watch is not on mute. So when your watch on mute, you will see that all settings are set to default and not vibrating and make sure that your watch is on a sound mode. Okay. So if these features are not working correctly, so it's time to do a factory reset. So if none of the above steps work, consider programming a factory reset on your Galaxy Watch 7. This will erase all data and so make sure to back up any important first. Okay. So to reset, you can simple go to settings and then go to general and then scroll down until you find reset. Okay. So before resetting, they will ask to reset your all mobile plans. Okay. So after that, click next and then they will ask for your backup, your data. Okay. And then you can simple tap on reset and then they will erase your all data and make your watch as new. After that, you can simple configure your watch again, set up it 
and then you can simple make sure to turn the vibration and other features correctly so if you found any problem in setting your watch so you can simple watch our youtube video on our channel how to set up galaxy watch 7 okay so if you found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial goodbye